Hello, welcome to the next episode of Sofa Time with Myris. I'm Dan Sharp, Sales Director here at Myris. I'm Paul Tomlinson, Managing Director at Myris. So what we're going to talk about today is about print and more specifically managed print. So um, as people might not know, we bought a managed print company about two years ago. Um, a company that used to be called 2R Systems. Um, I guess do you want to give us a bit of background in why we bought that company and what well, the rationale was? I guess the first thing is hopefully marketing has done a good enough job to tell people we've bought a business like that. Otherwise, Hopefully, we'll have a conversation with marketing. Um, so, so yeah, to to talk about why we did it. I mean, there's there's two reasons. Obviously, that one is the business case, and the other is more around the technical reasons. Um, Myris has grown organically through the years. Um, you know, things have continued to go very well. Um, but we've always had a very good relationship uh, with Richard, who manages the managed print business. And actually, we were referring a lot of clients across to his business, and the relationship was working really well. Um, so we just felt that actually bringing that in-house and trying to drive that service a little bit more within the business was a positive thing. Um, so we were able to obviously bring the print business into the group um, and that gave us more customers to sell IT services to, but it also meant that we had the skill set in-house to deliver print to our existing um, IT customers. And we were starting to see, I think it's fair to say, that they were unhappy with the income providers. Um, because of price or service, lots of different reasons. So, yeah. so actually, it was a, a really positive move to to benefit both existing customers, but also to give us more customers to to sell those services too. And I think the the print team's kind of values and the way they work and the relationship with the customers kind of is very similar to the way that we want to work—a kind of open, honest relationship. And, yeah, yeah, and that's worked really well, hasn't it? Uh, yeah, absolutely. I, I don't think we could have brought uh, it couldn't have gone any better really you know that as you say they're very similar people in their, their kind of approach and you know that made the integration very easy so whereas if we had a you know brought in another company that was slightly different and more traditional kind of you know what yeah. people might view copier companies as then um, then it might have been a bit different so i guess that that's a, a, the bit of the business case as to why we did it i guess the other reason as we kind of touched on is is the technical aspects and how prints changing and the extra services that they're now starting to deliver to their customers. I guess the biggest one is probably secure print, particularly with from a GDPR perspective. Yeah, so last year, obviously, as we were kind of coming up to the uh, the May deadline for GDPR, um, there was a big drive around secure print. And, um, you know, I think everyone's guilty of um, getting distracted when they send a print job, leaving it on the printer occasionally. And sometimes those print jobs were obviously confidential, and, you know, so... so as part of kind of the preparation for GDPR for us internally and for some of our other clients, we configured these secure print solutions. So well, I guess we should give a bit of an overview of what secure print is. Yeah, I think that would help. Yep. Do you want to do that? Yeah, so I guess whether you're, if you've got access control fobs, you know, little door fobs that used to access the building, or maybe you have individual cards or key codes that maybe you enter for a department, um, your document that you send to the printer is only released to actually physically print as you either fob it or touch it or enter your code. So you don't end up, as we said, with printing, let's say the accounts team decide that they need to print every salary in the business, coming out the printer and then sprinting over to the printer to grab it as quickly as they yeah, can. Yeah, or forgetting to and then everyone wondering... Whose is this? Yeah, why that person's paid so much. Yeah. yeah. Um, so yeah, I think that's a good summary of secure print and obviously the benefits of it. Um, so. So yeah, I think we've, we've certainly seen a lot more demand for those type of services. Um, we're also seeing a lot more integration between um, what the printer can do, the actual device, and then what we do from an IT perspective. Um, and we see that you know there's a, a large proportion of the calls that actually are dealt with by the service desk around integration of the actual physical device and services that we provide. Um, so scanning from the device into SharePoint, for example, or um, document management and making sure that you know, using third-party tools that we can scan documents directly into the accounts package. So we've got purchase invoices and workflows around those type of things. So, so it's, it's so much more than a physical print device now. And with the team that we've got, um, we're able to deliver those kind of third-party integrations. Um, and, it, and it's making a huge difference in terms of productivity, but also security of information. And, and I guess secure print it gives an element of cost control as well because obviously people don't send things to a printer that they don't actually need to print or they've printed by accident or yeah yeah and we've got some clients i think you know on that particular thing that what they do is they delete the job if it's not been collected in a certain period of time um, because 
you don't really need it. If you've sent that job and then you, you know, the next day you go to release your print jobs, well, you did, probably didn't need the job you sent the previous day. So, so little tweaks like that can make a big difference to the, the actual copy costs and the print costs that people are paying on a monthly basis. So um, that's good. hopefully giving you a bit of an overview of A, why we bought uh, a print company and, and some of the technical advances we're seeing. So if you'd like to discuss any of that, secure print, scanning, document yeah. management. Or even replacing your existing copiers. Yeah, know, or, or just thing. actually replacing a, a, a dumb copier for a, a relatively another dumb copier, then um, get in touch with us and we'd love to help. Thanks, Thanks for your time. Bye-bye.